patients suffering from corneal diseases. Here, we also have the khidmat e khalq blood bank, which does its share of giving to society by providing free blood to patients in need. The Tahir Homeopathic Hospital is not only leading the way into new research in the field of homeopathy, but is also providing free homeopathic services to patients regardless of religion, culture, or economic status. Thousands of patients travel to Rabwa from far and wide to benefit from this service. To accommodate the large number of patients, Majlis Khudamul Ahmadiyya has undertaken a project to build a new permanent facility for the Tahir Homeopathic Hospital. The fazl -e umar Hospital in Rabba is also busy in providing for those in need. It serves not only the population of Rabba, but much of the surrounding areas as well. It is considered one of the best medical institutions in the area. Its staff of doctors and nurses work diligently. In spite of the excellent facilities and expert staff, the cost of treatment is minimal. The active sports community is indicative of a vibrant city. Special emphasis on sporting activities in Rabba. Football and cricket are the sports of choice. Other than these, there are facilities for other sports, such as basketball, volleyball and badminton. Recently, Majlis Khudamul Ahmadiyya has constructed a new sports complex which consists of outdoor lawn tennis and indoor squash courts. The complex now has a new health and fitness club in addition to the old swimming pool. All these facilities are enthusiastically used by city youngsters. The Rabwa Tazin Committee was established to keep the streets and neighborhoods of Rabwa clean and beautiful. It is their responsibility to plant and maintain trees along roadways and spray water to keep aerial dust to a minimum, as well as plant grass in open plots. These endeavors add color to the environment and keep the atmosphere fresh. A beautiful park in the Butul Hamth colony was created for the enjoyment of the population. It is a center of recreation where families can come and enjoy the facilities in private. Various modes of transportation link Rabwa to other cities. These include trains, buses, and taxis. Within the city, 
the most popular form of transportation is the bicycle. Without exception, the use of bicycles is more prevalent in Rabwa than in any other city in Pakistan. Everyone, regardless of age, uses the cycle for transportation. Other modes of transportation include cars, rickshaws, and horse-drawn buggies or tongas. Rabwa has all the public conveniences of an international city such as a post office, telegraph office, telephone exchange, banks, international currency exchange, and internet facilities. Rabba also has offices for local newspapers and magazines published by the Central Jamaat organization as well as two printing presses which facilitate both Jamaat and private needs. Rabba's bazaars and various shopping centers are usually bustling with activity during shopping hours. All kinds of merchandise is readily available. However, the real attraction here is that when the call for prayers echoes through the town, shopkeepers leave their shops and go offer their congregational prayers in the nearest mosque or place of worship. As the international headquarters of the Ahmadiyya community, this city is second to none as it has been blessed by the presence of three caliphs or successors of the promised Messiah. Indeed, our present Imam was born and raised in Rabba. Rabba is not only a city, but also is a history replete with outstanding examples of personal sacrifice and blessed leadership. This is a city of those outstanding personalities whom humanity can be proud of, who gave their lives for the service of Islam and whose excellent example of spirituality is a model for the world to follow. This city is a glorious example of the kind of hard work and determination which causes revolutions. It was that determination which turned a desert into a lush garden and desolate land into a populated organized settlement. This is a living city. Each day in Rabwa heralds the dawn of greater advancement. And from here, each day, the trumpet call of Islam resounds further as the Ahmadiyya community strives to convey its message to the corners of the earth. Rabbu